Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you guys how to jailbreak your iOS 13.1.1 device with no computer. This is 100% untethered. And by the way guys, this is my iPhone XS, so it's one of the later versions, so it does work with A12. So I'm just going to open up this app, um, open up Cydia for you guys and show you. Uh, it's got all the features. Just give it a second to load here. Um, again guys, it's super easy. Uh, only takes like two minutes of your time. Um, no computer, untethered. So as you can see, uh, I have Cydia with all the features. Um, again, I am on 13.1.1 right now. I have not updated. So anyways, guys, this does work. Um, so I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do this. So just follow along with me. So open up Safari, guys, first of all. And make sure you do it on Safari. It only works on Safari. Go to the website, apphacks.co slash Cydia. Okay, there it is, apphacks.co slash Cydia. And basically, um, yeah, just hit the go button again. Make sure you do it in Safari. Okay, and basically this is going to install the Cydia installer profile. So just click the allow button, okay? And um, then open up settings quick. And as you can see, it says profile downloaded. So just go ahead and click on that. As you can see, it says Cydia. Um, click install. Uh, just enter in your passcode quick. And click next, next, install, install. Done, okay. So as you can see, I just updated my Cydia app. So I'm going to open that up again. Okay, and yeah, again, guys, uh, very easy method. Um, show you guys, explain to you guys how it works and how, because um, right now uh, you have the Cydia installer, but you just have to finish the installation to get access to all the features. So to begin the real installation, just click on any of the features here. So I'm going to click on manage account. Okay. Okay. So as you can see, it says injection required. So basically what the developers did was they found a loophole in the back end which allows you to get Cydia on your device um, without having to connect to your computer or you know do a bunch of crazy steps. So basically what you do is um, you click start injection. And again, I wanna explain the process to you guys so you understand that uh, basically the files for Cydia are hidden within these apps. And once you download and install the apps and leave them open for a set amount of time, then the rest of the files for Cydia will transfer over. Uh, it's actually very easy, guys. Um, so basically what you do is you click on start injection. Once you click start injection, it's going to take you to the uh, the content injection wizard. And from there, it'll instruct you to install and open about, like, install and open usually two apps and leave them open for like 60 seconds each. But guys, I want to make sure, um, let you guys know that you need to pay attention to each individual app's instructions. So if it says install and open this app for 30 seconds, just do that. If it says install this app, play the game up to like level five or something like that, make sure you do that because basically um, each app's instructions are different. So for example, in an app that says install this app and play up to like level five, that's when the files begin to transfer over because the devs, uh, the developers just had to be a little sneaky with it with this one. But yeah, other than that, man, you guys, other than that, you guys should be fine. Just follow the instructions, do exactly what the content injection wizard says to do and you'll be fine. Um, within like 30, it should, Cydia should load instantly with all the features available. If it doesn't, I recommend you restart your device. If it still doesn't load from there, you probably did something wrong with the injection. So just do the injection over again. Just make sure you pay attention to each individual app's instructions and you should be fine, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, again, uh, just head over to apphacks.co slash Cydia and get your guys' jailbreak, get your guys' devices jailbroken. Uh, thanks for watching.